My vote, my, my voice. voice. Kura yangu, sauti yangu. My name is Moses Esekon, a youth leader from Nakuru. I uh, gathered here youth leaders and student leaders from Nakuru County. Our objective of this presser is to mobilize young people to get out and vote in the forthcoming uh, ninth general election. Uh, this move was a, uh, informed by the low turnout during the voter registration and the recent party primaries. We have noted that there is a likelihood of voter apathy among the young people which could lead to undesirable leaders ascending to our electoral offices. So in it vote youth lobby will focus in, uh, on civic education among the youth and raise their concerns in regards to the electoral process with an aim of enhancing their participation. We will have a dialogue on the rights, obligation and responsibility of citizens and voters as well as the duty of electoral leaders. We will make sure the young people are aware of the correlation between policy-driven leadership and socio-economic and political prosperity as opposed to ethnic-based leadership which leads to a vicious cycle of poverty and corruption. Uh, we will inform and guide the young people on the right leaders to elect. We notice that if the youth get out to vote without guiding them, it will just be a waste of time and energy because the results would be the same. It's like a guided missile which you can't predict where it will land, either at the ocean or at, or at the residential areas. We purpose to hold town hall meetings to facilitate engagement with fellow young people so that they can understand the significance of them coming out to vote. Uh, my name is Sylvia Chumtai and I'm very humbled to come to you youths in Nakuru City to urge you to come out and vote on the 9th of August so that we can elect leaders who are effective, leaders who are going to be accountable for all of their actions and they're going to be accountable for our needs. So if you're a youth outside there and you believe that the system has not been going the way you want it to go, why don't you come out this time round and make sure that your voice is heard? Because here, working with Lee and knowing that Lee is the right candidate, we say, my vote my, my voice. voice. So make sure your vote becomes your voice. Thank you so much. Okay, kwa majina naitwa Daniel Kiptanui, kiongozi wa wanafunzi hapa Nakuru. So leo najiunga na wenzangu kuwaomba vijana wenzangu wa taifa letu la Kenya na jimbo letu la, la, la Nakuru tujitokeze sote tuje tupige kura tarehe 9 Agosti mwaka huu tupigie viongozi ambao watatusaidia. Ninawaambia kuwa hii ni wakati tutapiga vyo, tutapiga kura kama vijana. Hiyo wakati mwingine tutapiga kura tukiwa wazazi. Na kura hii yetu ni muhimu kwa sababu ni kura ambayo itaonyesha itaonyesha hali yetu ya elimu itaonyesha hali yetu pia na kazi na ni pia ndio ajira yetu kitu kingine na waomba vijana tuweke amani msimu huu tusitumike na, na wanasiasa vibaya tukae pamoja tushikane kwa sababu vita inaletwa wakati mimi na wewe tutakuwaruzana mimi na wewe tutatoana na mimi na wewe tutakosana wakati tutashikana tuwe na amani sisi kama vijana hakuna mtu atatutumia na sisi ndio tuko wengi vijana Kenya hii sisi ndio tunaongoza kwa asilimia sabini na sisi tukisema ni kushoto ni kushoto kulia ni kulia. Na sahi tunasema ni amani, amani, amani. Kura yangu, sauti yangu. And we want to enlighten youths in this political season that when you sell your vote, you have optioned your future. And not turning out to vote is as equal as voting in the wrong leaders. So when you look at the current political landscape, truly there is need for youths to turn out and vote in leaders whose decisions, actions and speech are backed by a serious intellectual foresight and knowledge of governance. Therefore, we are urging youths to turn up on August 9th to vote in Governor Liki Nyanjui because place, uh, your vote with, is safe with Governor Liki Nyanjui. Voting in Governor Liki Nyanjui is putting your vote where your future is. My vote, my, my voice. Kura yangu, sauti yangu.